Welcome to Sony Live Production Systems. Uh, good morning, everyone. My name is Matt Troyer, and it's great to see everybody here today. Now, today, Sony innovation continues. Our signature MVS 8000X and MVS 7000X multi-format switchers now feature an innovative, fully redesigned control panel. Sony now introduces the new X panel. Uh, we've expanded the capabilities of the high-performance MVS line with our most powerful and configurable design ever. An innovative control surface, fully customizable for every application, features enhanced visual design and new modules. Our new MVS data management system allows you to network studio to studio, coast to coast, and even around the globe. And for the first time, remote and touch tablet integration a virtual workspace that opens up a world of possibilities beyond the control room. Uh, we have an exciting feature set for you today. Uh, one innovation that we're very excited about is how the new panel design allows you to customize the layout for your application. Uh, Sony was the first to manufacture a configurable switcher control panel. And now, we've taken it a step further with a newly designed internal architecture. Our system control unit uses independent ethernet and power connectivity for each row of the control panel. So you now have the flexibility to decide how best to mount individual modules and complete flexibility in how you mount the individual rows on the panel. The panel can even be split into two or more positions, as you can see here. Independent power to each row gives you an extra level of system redundancy. The new MVS control panel also offers an innovative button technology designed to give the technical directors more flexibility in assignment. The new highly reliable RGB crosspoint buttons combined with the LED group indicator provide TDs the flexibility to group sources by color as they choose. In addition, the new MVS control panel features OLED displays with a higher resolution, improved readability, and up to four lines of text. Sony also created an ingenious LCD button design. Our unique technology features a high resolution LCD panel with clear buttons mounted above it. So this provides the tactile feel that TDs prefer, but it also gives them the ability to color code the buttons on the fly. These right here. Uh, these, this new LCD button module is used throughout the MVS control panel including the popular FlexiPad and utility shop box modules, as well as the new function module in the crosspoint section. And it gives the operator even more operational capabilities. Our new X panel also includes enhanced modules. You've got the upgraded transition module, and this provides now dedicated buttons for control over all eight ME keyers and our new shop bar module. And that gives you additional, additional versatility with macros directly relating to your primary cross points, machine control, and effect recall. Packed with powerful features, the new control panel takes customization to the max with flexible mounting options. And it gives you an option to set it up in a traditional flat mount or mounted curved for a more ergonomic shape. Next, our new MVS data management system. This allows you to share data and interconnect switchers within your studios across your organization, and it enables data transfer through a web-based application. With MDM, you can integrate every MVS switcher in your studio, bureau, network, or sister station across the country and even around the globe. Each switcher has the ability to link to each other or to a centralized file server. So the possibilities here are endless. Transfer key files and profiles from one control room to another, both domestic facilities and international studios as well. You can send show files directly from your control room switcher to your remote truck out in the field. Share your shot box, snapshots, effects, and macros files with others in your network or ownership group. And the graphics department can now easily distribute graphics files to every studio in your network. Uh, we use a web-based interface, so there's no software to install. What does that mean? Any computer or tablet on your network can easily access MDM. Now, other features include data backup and restore features, automatic log collection, enabling Sony's award-winning service group to troubleshoot issues and find solutions even faster, 
and the alarm view. Now this gives you real-time diagnostics of the systems from any location. Now the new MVS data management system for the MVS 8000X and MVS 7000X can also connect with MVS 3000A and MVS 6530 switchers on your network. And now, <laughs> our coolest feature of the MVS line, tablet control. Now this is an exciting new addition to Sony's high-performance MVS switcher line. Now throughout this presentation, you've probably noticed I've had this Android tablet. Now with our new virtual workspace, you now have the freedom and the flexibility to move beyond the control room. Endless applications are available here. Now, you can create a virtual shop box on a tablet, enable macros and command recall, take your virtual shop box outside of the control room onto the studio room floor, so you can preview effects on a monitor wall with your talent and your producers from the set. The TD is no longer tethered to the control room. Uh, this application can also be used by others. So the operator can preload macros, and then another member of the control room team or a producer can recall the effects using the tablet. And once the show is over, everything can be saved to your virtual workspace. All right, to summarize, technologically advanced and packed with an innovative feature set, the new MVS control panel is a virtual workspace designed to meet the needs of a wide range of productions. Customize the switcher for back-to-back -back show productions for a more efficient workflow with less turnaround time. Configure for personal preferences and lessen the opportunity for mistakes. Mount the panel flat, curved, or stepped up. You get to decide. High performance and innovation are at the heart of our design philosophy. The new MVS control panel offers increased production capabilities, better show performance, and integrates with your existing MVS 8000X or 7000X switcher mainframe. At Sony, we design with both the operator and business in mind, and we continue the stellar performance and reliability of the MVS line. Okay, so you've heard from me. Now let's talk to one of our TDs who can give you their insights into what they find the most exciting aspects of the new X-Panel. And bringing up to the stage right now is our friend Jason. Hi, Jason. Hi, man. How are you? Good. How are you? I'm very well. Thank you. All right. So let's just talk a little bit about what, what are some of the highlights that you're really excited about? Well, the thing I really like about this panel is this is one of the panel. The, the purpose of this entire design is for me. It's not about the switcher hardware boards, but it's based on the design for how I do news. And that's okay. the really exciting thing for me. The whole layout, the ability to be able to group things into colors for both on this color strip as well as the buttons, the better spacing from, um, from my perspective. I really like this LCD uh, uh, button panel. It's uh -huh. a touchscreen button panel. And it allows me to change with the MEM controlling, the aux buses I'm routing, the tables I've got assigned to the buttons. Anything I need is right here and um, available for me, which is, which is something that's going to make it a lot easier for me to switch. I'm going to be more accurate, and it's going to be easier for me to get to complex effects, aux bus routings, and things like that during the show. Right, and in terms of the setup of the actual panel, wh what do you see as some of the benefits of that, the flexibility of it? Well, it, and it's just that. It's just the fact that even in the setup of the panel, like you said, I've got the arc design, I've got the step up. Um, you know, I can kind of customize it from my control room, and it doesn't have to be the way that everybody else in the country chooses to purchase the switcher. It's best how it fits my home. I can take panels, because they're IP and power separate, I can take them and actually move them to different areas that make sense, again, from my workflow in my control room. Control rooms don't always have you know, they're not always laid out the same, so sure. I can't always base mine on how every other TV station in the country is. But in my design, I can really make it customized to work best for my workflow. Terrific. And before we move to the tablet and the, you know, the giving you the freedom to get out of the control room, tell us a little bit about the data management system. What do you think about that? Data management system is great, especially in news in my environment, because I can take all the stations that are part of my stations group, and I can push graphics back and forth between my stations. I can get images from stations, and I can do all my lo loading and saving directly to a network server. And I don't have to just use, you know, just the hard drive on the switcher, and I can share effects. So when we get a new graphics package for all my stations group, I can make the new two box, three box, four box effects and push it to all the other stations. So now everybody has to repeat the same workflow. Work awesome. Yeah. All right, and now let's talk about getting you out of the control room. Yeah. <laughs> uh, the best part I think is this new tablet that um, is part of the new panel design. And the thing I like about this is at what everybody is trying to do with news is make it more interactive between the person on camera and the, s and the set pieces, the monitors and things like that. And and with this tablet, I can provide this to an anchor, and on a story-by-story -story basis, I can get, I can let this person control aux buses.
devices, do transitions in monitors and things like that, and they have the ability to do whatever they want. And I can limit them on a story-by-story -story basis or an output or an ME basis and give them the control and the flexibility I want them to have, and I don't have to give them the entire switcher. It's really right. going to maximize the interactivity between you know, the talent and the technology. And not only I, you can do the buttons, you can customize the buttons, and you've got some bitmaps as well, so yep. you can have pictures, really easy icons for people to use. Yep, they can see the icon of exactly what, them, exactly what I allow them to do right on the screen. Terrific. All right, thank you, Jason. Now let's talk to another TD who can share more insights about how this X panel can provide awesome benefits for both the operators and management. We're bringing you to the stage now, Lucinda. Hello, Lucinda. Great, how are you? Uh, tell everybody a little bit about yourself, background. Um, I'm a freelance TD. I live in the Los Angeles area, and I do predominantly entertainment shows. Awesome. So where do you want to start? I want to start with that tablet. Okay, here, let's start with the tablet then. Absolutely. <laughs> you are ready to be untethered. I am, I am. I, I think that this is the greatest invention I, um, as far as being able to delegate out power to the switcher to different groups. I would like to use this as um, a tool for my um, assistant directors to be able to do changes on graphics and things to sort of free up the switcher for that. I'd also like to be able to take it out to my talent and let them be able to do changes in the monitor that they're standing right beside in the middle of an interview to be able to jump back and forth between a subject so they aren't stuck with whatever the script said. Sure. They can let it be free flow and a lot more interactive that way. Um, I like the icons. I like the fact that I can put color and, and, pi and pictures on here, which allows them to do recall a little easier, you know, yep. a little quicker to be able to recognize what they want to recall. And you can even change the size of the button. So I can. you could have one big button make it really easy. Yes, hit this one here. <laughs> Great Very idea. good. Absolutely. All all right, and then let's talk about the panel itself. I'll put this back up here and just talk about the, the panel a little bit. What, what is exciting to you? Um, a big issue always in television is being able to recall the amount of effects and macros and different things that we have. And the fact that this is an OLED um, a display, the clarity and, and the ease of reading is so nice on it. And I can find and categorize my um, effects and macros a lot easier. I like the color strip. That gives me a way to kind of identify and <coughs> segment off different things. And then these buttons will also have different colors. So I can group even further so I can find quickly recalls that I need to get to. Okay, sure. Um, and then LCD panel? The LCD panel's great. Um, it's, it's, uh, it has actual plastic buttons on it, which I like the texture of it. I like to be able to press a button and know I've pressed it. Sure. And when you're doing a long show or, and, and have to have your hand hovering over something, you want to be able to like rest it on there and then do an actual touch when you want to fire that effect or fire that graphic. So it's quite good that way. And then these are uh, programmable buttons, so they can be various things from macro recalls to t changing tables in all sets of macros along as it goes. So they're very powerful as well as being just nice buttons. And what were some of the things that you liked about the flexibility of the setup of the panel y itself? You know, not everybody is six foot tall <laughs> and, and has the reach, right? right? And we have such large panels now because of all the things we need to get to. And the fact that we can slope or arc this really helps me. It gives me a, a nice angle on the OLED so I can see. And it makes the top buttons, especially for the far away top buttons, as you can see, <laughs> easy to reach. <laughs> right. Yeah. And then finally, uh, the data management system. You know, what are some of the uses that you could see for that? Um, data management is really going to help, in, at least in my world, especially with the graphics interface, because the graphics then can be pushed in as they're building them. They're never quite done. You know, they're always last minute. So the fact that they can be pushing graphics to my switcher from their graphics machine makes it much quicker and easier to actually push them in. Awesome. Well, Lucinda, thank you thank very you. much. Appreciate your insights. And now we're going to talk to one more TD. We're going to bring up to the stage our friend Ross. Hi, Matt. How you doing? Good. How are you? Very good. Uh, let's start with a little bit of your background. Tell folks who you are. My name's Ross. I'm a uh, freelance TD based out of Northern California and primarily doing sports. Okay, very good. So let's talk a little bit uh, highlights. What are you most excited about right now with the new panel? Well, you know, in sports, it's, it's unscripted and it's very fast paced. So I need to have multiple sources and multiple effects available to me at a moment's notice. And with the new panel, these high visibility buttons and the high visibility OLEDs are so easy to read that I'm going to be able to find the sources and find the effects that I need at a moment's notice. And I don't have to spend time making sure that I've found the correct item. 
Okay, very good. Uh, and in terms of uh, layout, what, do, what are your thoughts on the flexibility of the layout? Well, the nice part about the layout is I can really design it so that I can put the pieces where they're comfortable for me. Because different TDs like to have different features in different areas. Okay. Some people, you know, their right hand is more prominent than their left hand. So they, I can put the pieces where I need them. And the other thing, as far as laying it out, is that shot bar. Uh, with a high resolution, multicolored LED display, I'm going to be able to group the items that I need right in front of me and find them very quickly. Terrific. All right. Um, do you want to talk tablet or data management system? Where do you want to go? Yes. Yes, both. All right. Let's talk data There's management There's so much first. we could talk about here. <laughs> okay. Let's do data management and then we'll wrap it up with the tablet. Well, you know, with a lot of the regional sports networks now, they all have the same graphics packages and the same effects. And what's nice about data management now is we can take uh, newly created graphics and newly created effects and send them out to all of the trucks that, uh, that are doing our shows. We don't have to ship uh, or email and, and use thumb drives. So this is going to be great for just transferring new information out to the trucks and having the best look for all of our shows all of the time. Okay, very good. All right, and now let's talk tablet. Well, the cool thing about this tablet is I can get out of the truck. And a lot of okay. times we're having meetings with the talent and the camera operators, and we're down on the field or we're down on the court, and we're trying to look at uh, different uh, shots and different clips of different uh, parts of the show. This way I can be out with them instead of being stuck in the truck, and I can control what we're showing, and we can look at different clips and look at different shots, and so it takes me out of the, out of the truck. Right. The other nice thing is when we're doing roundtable discussions, I can give this to my color analyst and he can call up the shots that he needs or the clips that he needs that they want to talk about without having to relay it to the truck who then has to relay it to the tape operators who then have to relay it to me. This is going to be a lot quicker and a lot simpler. Thank you, Ross, and thanks to all of our TDs. Folks, if you have questions on the new X panel, make sure you talk to one of our TDs here or one of our friendly Sony representatives who are very excited to share the new benefits and the exciting design of the new X panel. Thank you very much.